Hey everybody, welcome back to Jimmy's Promo, and today we're going to talk about an update that happened sometime late last week inside of your 3D scanner of the Galaxy Note 10 series that allows you to not only do a 3D scan of a thing, but it also allows you to now do a person. Now, if you were here with the very first 3D scanner video I did, it did give me the option of two things, scanning a thing or a person. But then right after that, an update happened and it got rid of the person option. But now when you head inside of your camera and you move over into more, then you want to go inside of Bixby Vision and then inside of Bixby Vision, this is where you go inside of 3D Scanner. Now inside of here, this is where you have those two different options. You can choose either a person or you can choose a thing. Now I do have to say, if you try to scan a person or if you try to scan a thing, and if for some reason it states that it can't find anything, but the object or person is inside of that circle, simply just toggle it to the other and move it back to what you are scanning and it'll pick it up pretty quick. So here is a demo of how you're able to get this done. You're really not able to have your person or object, you know, circle around themselves or put it on a little lazy Susan or something like that. You actually have to walk around the object or around the person and really what's happening is the time of flight sensor the camera everything is placing it on an XYZ axis letting it know exactly this is this side this is this side and it really shows you even the arrows to spin around the object or the thing now one little tip to make sure you guys know is that when you are spinning around the person or the object uh, when you're looking around and you see those blue little dots you want to make sure that those go away and they turn black so this way the object itself is going to be that lighter white color then you know for a fact that you're getting a good scan now another really fun thing you're able to do is when you're inside of the 3d scanner when you click on your gallery of images that you took on the very bottom left hand side you can see where it says mapping or add to map now, once you add it over into the map, it's basically able to animate it and you're able to go inside of your camera. And with that object looking at another person, that little object will copy exactly what the human or person is doing. And so you'd be able to lift up your left arm, lift up your right arm. Uh, I didn't really pick up the jumping up and the down, but it'll pick up if you're spinning around, doing a whole bunch of movements, moving to your left, moving to your right. It's actually really fun to interact with it. And you can take a video of it or a picture. If you go underneath the video option and you start recording it, then you're able to capture the person who is doing its movements, having that object do it along with it. And you can share it on Facebook and everywhere else. Now to finish off this video, if you guys do need a little bit more help or a little bit more tips of exactly how you can scan a person or a thing or object or whatever, when you head inside of your little Bixby vision, you go inside of that 3D scanner, on the top right hand side, you can go to the help section. And then this is where you can learn about scanning people. So it mentions to take off glasses. So I had my son take off his glasses because reflections will make it look crazy wonky uh, and it just has a couple other things and, and things to note down there when you're scanning your things you want to make sure that it's going to be something that is a certain size uh, and you want it to be light you don't want it to be a dark room uh, i also kind of tried to figure out a way that you had light that's kind of even on both sides because just like you know with 360 videos things like that you're going to see a lot of big differences uh, between a light area and a dark area and this is where you can learn about playing with models so you can share things you can uh, map it to the model you can take pictures videos kind of like what we just got done kind of looking at but i hope you guys have liked this video if you guys did please give this thing a huge thumbs up don't forget to hit on subscribe subscribe right over here on the very bottom left hand side and if you like this video the more than likely you'll also like this video and i'll see you guys later